guys, what's up? So I accidentally freaking deleted my everyday makeup tutorial, which is kind of annoying, but <laughs> it's okay. It's fine. It's really fine. I'm okay about it. It's totally mm. fine. I'm good with it. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm fine. It's, it's, for sure. It's fine. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, I'm good. so good. Oh my god. <laughs> All right. Well, anyway, just disregard that. Uh, welcome back to my channel. So I am actually literally going to do an everyday makeup routine. So let's freaking get started. So obviously I start off by trying to style my hair, but it, oh my God, what's wrong? Oh, it smells. Here's my deodorant. start off with my makeup I usually use a moisturizer this is my favorite one it's by Clinique I can't say it it's called moisture surge then I go in with the elf primer this is also a very good primer but honestly I really don't think primer works I just use it to use it then I use these two guys um, it's the Maybelline BB cream and then whatever that is I don't remember I'll put the name on the screen I mix those together because they're not the correct color and then I use a beauty blender and blend it all in super easy super fun super quick and it looks pretty good once I'm done with it then I go in with this like Becca under eye brightening thing but you could also use the Maybelline rewind because they're pretty much the same thing except the Becca one is like a little tackier and it smells like lip gloss like it's weird like like kids lip gloss then once I'm done with that I go in with the Tarte Shape Tape I have two one for my skin and one for my under eye circles and then for powder I use the Cody Airspun because it's super cheap and I kind of just bake under my eyes with that This is so boring. Guess what song I'm singing, because I don't remember actually. So tell me what song I'm singing, because I have no idea. Then I go in with the tattoo thingy from Maybelline. I don't know. This stuff works so well. Like, I'll take a nap and my eyebrows will still be on. It's kind of crazy. So this is an Anastasia brush that I bought on AliExpress. This was like two bucks and it's not actually an Anastasia brush. It's just a knockoff, but it works the same. But I actually lost it just the other day. So rest in peace, Anastasia Beverly Hills eyebrow brush. That is fake and that cost me $2 that I could at least easily repurchase, but I'm not going to because I'm lazy. Then I just go in and clean up my eyebrows with my Tarte Shart Shit Tape Concealer. This takes forever. This is like the longest thing because I don't have any eyebrows so I have to freaking make them look even every single morning. This is taking so long. I could literally take more time. Like really right now. Can you hurry up? See, I have to draw on the ends of my eyebrows because I want them to be like, like this is my fault that it takes me so long because I pluck my eyebrows off like that. Because I want them to be straight. See, I'm getting bored. I'm getting bored. Okay, here we go. Then we use the Meat Matrimony palette. I don't know where this is from. The balm, I think. I think so. And then I just use a couple of the powders from there to freaking set my eyebrows. Finally, we're done with eyebrows. Thank God. Okay, this is still taking a long time. Hurry up. Oh, there we go. I'm using the Fit Me Powder. I actually don't like this. Here we go, the Hula Bronzer. Now, I have the Hula Bronzer, but there's a dupe. It's the NYC city bronzer or something they're literally the exact same so honestly just buy that but i don't think they sell that in stores anymore so look for it on amazon don't know why i'm giving it a free promo but honestly it's better than the hula bronzer but anyways
Also, guess what TV show I was watching? Just kidding, I'm, you don't have to guess. It was The Act, which is such a good TV show. I recommend it. And then I also use that for eyeshadow, because I'm lazy, and I think it looks good. And I think a lot of people use bronzer as eyeshadow. I thought I was like one of the only ones, but I guess I'm not, because I was watching other makeup tutorials and they were using bronzer as eyeshadow, so I guess I'm not as special as I thought I was. Oh, and I also kind of contour my nose with it, but I think I'm gonna stop doing that because it like makes my nose look weird. I just like, it's fun to contour it, but like, here's my Tarte blush. I just started wearing blush. Here's a dupe, it's the e.l.f. blush. I don't know what the names are, I'm sorry. And I really like blush. I just recently started wearing it and I think it looks super cute, so definitely recommend it. Now I'm putting on fake freckles. I love putting on fake freckles. Fake freck freak freckles fake freckles for the summertime you know it's cute the sun's out my freckles are out i'm feeling good i'm feeling sexy and free oh oh my god oh i'm so cute look at my girl oh my god oh okay and then for highlight this is my favorite highlighter it's by becca i've had it since 2014 which is disgusting but i don't care it freaking works for me see how empty it is but it still works it's great. I love it. I'm not going to repurchase it. I don't care if it's freaking five years old. That's disgusting. Disregard that I just said that because that's really gross, but yeah. The Morphe Setting Spray. Honestly, I don't think this works that well. Ever since I filmed this video, I've actually been using the Pixie Setting Spray. That's really good. This is my Colleen, I don't know why, I put it on so weird. This is my Colleen Ballinger lipstick. I love Colleen Ballinger and I like her lipstick, it's really cute. And then for mascara, I use the Maybelline Falsies. I also like Urban Decay Perversion, I've been using that more recently and I also love the Rocket by Maybelline. I've been using that since like 2014, so that's a really good one too. Okay, well, I'm still putting mascara on. It's taking me a while, huh? Still doing that. Oh, oh, you think I'd be done. You really would think I'd be done by now. But I'm still going. Am I done? No, I'm not done. Still putting on mascara. Am I done now? I think I'm done now. Oh, she looks so cute, but she still has her tag on her shirt, so. Oh, nose highlight. Okay, now we're done, right? Let's be finished. No. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think we're done, we're done, right? We're done. We're done, and she looks so cute. Here we are. Here's the final completed makeup look, and I'm doing all sorts of crazy expressions. Oh my gosh, I'm so quirky and fun and cute, and a teenager, and I'm quirky and cute. All right, well, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a big fat thumbs up. Make sure to press that subscribe button down below. Thanks for 800 subscribers. Love you guys. Peace out. Catch you up on the flip side. Said that wrong, catch you out on the flip side. Peace out, Girl Scouts. You know how it is, you know how it be, alright, you know what, goodbye, catch you next time.